to stop talking to you with that tone. I'm only an hour late, like last week, yesterday, the past month. Okay, you know what? There's traffic and I can't help it. I live in Boston. There's traffic every hour of the day. Yeah. Now, I can hear a call coming in. Would you like me to talk about my problems with you? Or would you like me to help other people with their problems? Yeah, because I can still hear you from there. You need to stop being so rude. I'm going to quit. Okay, no, I'm not going to quit. But you need to stop being so rude. Okay? See ya. God, a call coming in. I didn't even clock in yet. Let me clock in real quick. I'm not picking this up. I'm not doing free work. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Now we'll wait a few seconds. Great. Now we're one. What is your emergency? What do you mean? What took so long? It was just like a good 10, 15 seconds. Okay. Tell me about your problems. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so what is the emergency? Oh, sorry, I missed that part. Your house is burning down. Okay, um, any injuries? <clears throat> no injuries? No, no ambulance for you. Um, let me see, like, one fire truck? Okay, one. What were you doing? Oh, of course you were cooking. I mean, it must be pretty lit in there, right? Yeah, that's why your house is burning down. What were you cooking exactly? Well, that's unfortunate. You burned down a house cooking pizza. Okay. Well, you know what? I'm not going to roast you anymore. I'm pretty sure your house is roasted enough as is. So, Well, I'm sending you some fire people. They're coming in like five minutes. Well, your house is halfway burned down. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Maybe you can live in half the house and not the other half. Well, they're not magicians. They can't teleport. They'll be there as soon as they can. I'll send you some police too, okay? I don't know what they're going to do, but they'll be there. Now, is there anything else I can help you with today? Okay, great. Good luck with your house and your insurance. Bye. Well, it's not even summer yet. So my house is burning down. Like, how do you burn down a house making pizza? Like, did, did the pineapple burn? Even though you don't put pineapple on your pizza? Okay, well, that's your problem. <laughs> oh, man. What is up with all these down one calls? There's like 50 of us here. And somehow, it's always mine that rings. Now, one, one, what is your emergency? Okay, I, I think I recognize your voice. I, Amanda, are you serious? You calling back again? What's going on this time? How's your kids? They're fine? Great. Someone is in your house again. Again? No, I'm not going to get you help. But, oh, actually, I think you need help. I think you need to see a psychiatrist. You're being paranoid. Ma'am, it is 2.35. I think your kids just got out of school and they just came home. Why were you hiding in your room? You know you live with your kids, right? Okay, you know what? Kids are monsters. You're right. But do you really need an, some police assistance with them? Exactly. You'll be fine. You know what, Amanda? I'm just going to tell you, as a friend, you need to stop calling me. I know you want to talk to me, but you have really bad excuses. Stop. It's not funny. Yeah, Amanda. Goodbye. Take care of your kids, okay? Say hi. Yeah, okay, bye. Oh, God, Amanda, I swear to God, you call me one more time. I literally hear your voice every day. She's paranoid. She needs help. You know, next time she calls, I'm gonna get her arrested. I'm seeing some cops over there and say, she's a drug dealer. She's doing drugs and she's dealing them. Put her in jail. That'd be fine, right? She deserves it. Stupid Amanda. Oh, next one. Now, one, what is your emergency? <clears throat> mm hmm. Oh, no, you didn't. Okay, you know what? I will send a SWAT team over. Yeah. Absolutely, I'll send you some. Oh, 
This is terrorism. He hits you and he's trying to drive away. No, you block that. You block him with your car. He's not going anywhere. I'm just gonna use some SWAT. A SWAT team. I don't know, some drones maybe. What is wrong with him? I want you to get out of the car, walk up to him, ask him to roll down the window, and then slap him in the face. Or punch him in the face, whichever one you prefer. Okay, you know what? I'll send an ambulance too, just in case. Maybe you get hurt, okay? SWAT team's on the way. Ooh, that is outrageous. I hate people that does that. So rude and disrespectful. If they hit you from behind, where's he gonna go back up and go the other way? Well, you're stuck in traffic, so you can't even go anywhere. Block his car. He's not going anywhere. Yeah, the SWAT team will be there in like three minutes on a helicopter. Mm -hmm. No, well, you're in the middle of the highway, so. Yeah, I can triangulate your position. I don't really do that. If something is so outrageous, I'm not gonna ask you where you live. I'll just find out. Because that is outrageous. Yeah. You know what? I wish you the best of luck, and I hope that douchebag gets what he deserves. Uh, laying him in jail or something. I don't know. Yeah. Good luck, bye. Oh my god. I hate stupid people. Okay, we're on with plans for tonight. Yeah, I haven't been out for so long. Oh. 911, can you hold on for a second? I'm on another call. Yeah. Give me one second. Okay. Do you want to get sushi tonight? It's 50% off. Or sashimi. Sandwich. Alright. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, what is your emergency again? Okay, not that much of an emergency. A welfare check? Sure. Your grandparents? Yeah, okay. Just tell me their address, please. What, what, what? Can you repeat that? Okay, where do they live again? This is the United States. We do not do welfare check if your grandparents are in Canada. Or Africa, I don't care where they are. We can't do well. Are you kidding me? Can you call the 911? I don't even know what number they have in Canada, but can you call them? Yeah, this is nowhere close to Canada. If you want us to do a welfare check, it's going to take us at least 10 hours to get there. At least. Yeah. Okay, bye. You're being so stupid. It sounds like random. Are you calling 911 in the United States to do a welfare check for your grandparents in Canada? 21st century, people are so stupid nowadays. Good. Great. I can finally breathe. I'm sweating from all this anger. These stupid people. Okay. 911, what is your emergency? Yeah. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh no, did it really? Oh, again? You know what, let me send some police over. That's that's outrageous. There's so many outrageous things today. KFC ran out of chicken? What are they gonna sell? Tacos? Yeah, I'm sending some cops over there right now. I'm pretty sure they're just messing with you. Because the name's KFC, is Kentucky Fried Chicken. If they ran out of chicken, they just Kentucky Fried it. Where's the chicken at? Yeah, they're just messing with him. Don't worry, I'm sending you some cops right now. Go talk to the, the what did you call him? The drive through window cashier. She said there's no chicken. What is she offering you? Salad? Chicken Caesar salad with other chicken? They don't even sell that, do they? No, but if they ran out of chicken, they can't open it. So they're lying. Don't worry, cops are on their way. Is that the KFC near the river? Okay, great. I know, I go there all the time, but they never told me they ran out of chicken. Did you do something to them? And either way, it's outrageous. I'm sending you someone right now. They'll be there in 10 minutes. Yeah. Oh, if they do have chicken, can you deliver? Yeah, yeah, give me your number. 
Yeah. Yeah, I'll send you my address. I'll text it to you later. Just give me some, like a bucket of rice. Yeah, I've been here for like 10 minutes and I'm so hungry. Hand me some food. Thank you so much. Good luck with your problems. I'll see you later. Bye. Yo, I love these people. So nice. Give me like chicken and stuff. You deserve the cops. <clears throat> sushi or steak? Okay, Philly sushi. Yeah, I'm in Philly steak right now. I mean, I've been here for like 10 minutes. So, five more hours to go. Well, four minutes and 15 minutes to go because I'm clocking out as soon as I'm done. Number one, what is your emergency? Mm-hmm. Okay. How's your hand? Okay, so someone slammed the door on your hand. Well, honestly, you can't really sue them. It's an accident. Unless they did it on purpose, then... Okay, well, I'll send you an ambulance. Well, actually, I'm not going to send you an ambulance. They didn't slam the door on your leg. You can walk to the hospital. It's, like, pretty close, I guess. Just just take a taxi, Uber, or something. It's not that expensive. Uber is pretty cheap nowadays. Yeah. But there is bad traffic today, so... Yeah, but I'm not sending you an ambulance. What the hell? Your legs are working fine. Just walk over there. You're paying tax money for this. You know how expensive it is to send out an ambulance? It's pretty expensive. Oh, yeah. But can you send me the pictures of your hand? Are they, are they all bruised? Oh, yo. I can post that online. Can you send it to me? You know? You hung up on me. You hung up on me. Wait. Will she lose her hand? Well, no. I, I, I don't want that to happen to her. I hope she posts it online so I can see it, because I actually want to see it. Can you imagine just like, bam, 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 just flatten. It's pretty creepy. Number one, what is your emergency? Mm -hmm, this is a public disturbance call. Okay, tell me about your problems and I'll see what I can do. Okay, you live in an apartment, and you can hear your neighbors doing things next door. Was they banging on the walls? Okay, fine, I'll send you a cop nearby, which is three minutes away. Not an emergency. What well, is an emergency to your ears, because you can't sleep, but... Why are you sleeping at three in the morning? I mean, well, yeah, three in the afternoon. Oh, you work at night? I respect that. You deserve your sleep. I'll send you the police and uh, just give me your address. Mm -hmm. Zip code. State. Yes, I have to. Why do people just give me your state? Thank you. You know your city? Okay. We'll be there in three minutes. Good luck with your nap, though. Yeah. Bye. Hmm. Oh god, how long has it been? Like what, 15 minutes? What's going on here? Such a long day. And Amanda called today too, that's funny. Okay. Number one, what is your emergency? Yes, this is Alex. Hey, how'd you get this number? Wait, never mind, that's a dumb question. See, all these dumb calls making me dumb. How'd you, uh, how'd you find me, exactly? Yeah, it's so unfair, it's 50 of us here and they keep calling me. Yeah, I pretty much get 90% of the call nowadays. I should get a raise. You can hear me, I know you can hear me. I make $10 an hour, so what's up? Yeah, yeah, I texted you earlier. I'm, ha I'm asking if you want sushi or you want steak. I'm kind of feeling sushi, though. Yeah, well, I get sushi instead. I don't really feel steak. Yeah, I kind of want a sashimi. It's half off today. Well, tonight. Yeah, sure. But is there any emergency or anything? Are you sure? Do you want me to send someone over? 
Oh, he's in school. Yeah, that sucks. It's pretty much an emergency being stuck in school. But only you'll be out soon. I'm stuck here for another five hours, so. I'll find you tonight around five. I mean, eight. Yeah, yeah, perfect. I'll see you then, alright? Bye. Yo, I'm so hungry right now. I'm only gonna be here for another. For. 40 minutes? We're around 40 minutes? I think. Yeah. Oh my god. Well, at least not much emergency today. Just a woman's house burning down because she made pizza. <clears throat> so embarrassing. How do you explain that to your kids? Now and one. What is your emergency? I know there's so much traffic today. But that's not really an emergency. Well, let me tell you a little story. I was actually late today for work. Yeah, because of the traffic. Yeah, the city of Boston, maybe they should step it up. Maybe they should, like, expand the highway, add another lane. That would really ease up the traffic by at least 15 minutes in the morning. Let me tell you something. I drive to school. Yeah, before, obviously, I'm not, I don't work in school. But I drive to school, and it takes me an hour to get to school. And guess how far I live? Five miles. An hour. That that means I'm traveling like 10 miles per hour. Yeah, it's pretty slow. I could just ride a bike there and might as well get there earlier. But, I mean, I'm too lazy. I'd rather sit in traffic. But you know what I mean. But yeah, I cannot send you anybody right now. The highway is jammed. Ooh, I did send a SWAT team to the highway because someone was trying to do a hit and run. Yeah, that might have... Oh, sorry about that. It might kind of ruin the traffic hours even worse now that there's a SWAT team right there but you know what hit and run is wrong and they should be punished yeah yeah so yeah good luck in traffic though but I do suggest you get off the highway and exit 18 there's always nothing there well yeah there's a big loop but just try that out I don't know I work back Oh, baby. You know what? I need to eat. Hmm. Yeah, I can leave early, I think. Let's see. Okay, if I leave at 6, I still make $30. And I can still pay for rent this month. Eh. But I just have to stay for the rest of the month. Which is gonna be troublesome. But I do want to get some sushi early. Okay, this is a really, this is difficult. Oh, this, this is not helping. Number one, what is your emergency? You broke my chain of thoughts. Mm-hmm. Great. Mm-hmm. Okay. Alright, so, basically, you were riding your bike. And someone pushed you off your bike and you fell and what, what happened okay okay so you fell and you got hit by a car and now you're trying to find the guy that pushed you well honestly I think it's too late cuz he's probably gone yeah if you think about it I don't think they're gonna stay for that long and, well I'll try okay okay calm down I'll send you an ambulance even though you probably scratch your knees or something how's the car a little dent. It's not your fault though. Don't worry about it. I'll send you a car, uh, ambulance, you don't need a fire truck. I know your knee burns, but it's not burning, like, you know, burning down. Yeah, okay, no fire truck, just an ambulance. Can you give me your exact location? Mm hmm Okay, don't stop. I don't need to know your city. I know where you are. But yeah, because I live around here. Okay, well. The ambulance will be there in five minutes. The cops will be there in two minutes because you're just around the corner. And uh, good luck with your uh, future endeavor. I hope your knee doesn't burn down. <laughs> I mean, if it does, I'll send you a fire truck. But okay, anyway, bye. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, I can't do this. Yeah, I gotta leave. Yeah, I gotta go get sushi. I'll find you tomorrow. Okay.